They've come to their first event as a team. They've pretty much steamrolled through the entire tournament, losing just one match the whole time. Let's hear a big round of applause for Moscow 5. around that corner bush there baron is down to round about a third hp they get rid of the war that was in there we are going to see the flashes in and tsm make a massive charge onto moscow five Stop. alex gets a kill odd one will go down x special goes down then it's just going to be a bit of a snowball effect baron is picked up it's an ace on it's not i don't like him it's still alive but for how long <laughs> is the real question he is surely dead there goes the stun heal is used and there is the ace <laughs> actually do all that much at the, this point of the game. We are going to see now TSM move in for one last try. Diamonds is like, come here Reginald, you're not going to be involved in this fight. Pulls him away before he gets the kill in there and they are going all over to Moscow 5. Chaos is going to try and run himself away with the help of the ult. He can just <laughs> trying to get in there right at the end. But TSM and uh, you know they're gonna lose out to this one unfortunately Moscow 5 with six men alive right now since they've got that ghost there with them for a little bit of help as well and they are gonna go straight in onto the Nexus and Moscow 5 are gonna win the Intel Extreme Masters Global Challenge here Ready to flash engage here. He has headbutt Scar away. Manages to get caught out with a poor price. Scar is going to go down here. That is a quick, quick kill. Looks like it is just going to be Void Boy, although Void Boy is doing a good bounce of damage to Darian there. Has been baited into. You can see the Carpal Salty coming through. That will be enough to take him down. Has got Diamonds just below him, and Diamonds is coming out now. You can see managed to get the Rune Prison down on him. Oh, and a very good dark bindings there from Scar. Has to burn the flash, so it's going to get dived on the turret. I think he might be first, but yes, he will. Diamonds in range now. Dignitas is going to be a little bit difficult for them. They're still going to get lower and lower. Diamonds still sticking nearby. Darren picks up the turret kill at top. There's some pressure on Cutie Pie. The Shadow goes off. Diamonds got a giant shield and immediately go in. Morgana with the Zodias. The cop, Alex Nish. He is going to go down and now will it be Kendra? Looks like it's going to be the target. Boy, wait, no. Goes to Pepper. Going to take a massive amount of damage. Cutie Pie running away from Diamonds. The exhaust is on. Boy, wait, still going in, but falls to Kendra, who's incredibly powerful. Diamonds taking more damage. Cutie Pie, the Ignite, and all oh, the damage output. And now it looks like take the toss. Forced to run away. They've lost three. Locust will be stunned. They've now lost four. The Oracles is gone. Only Morgana alive. And there we go. Darian pulling up on Dragon. A great team for Moscow 5, even with Rise dying right away. Diamonds Chen is coming around the backside, though. It will be Scar they go for. Has got Zonya's Hourglass to use. Will he go for it at all? No, I think it's a little bit too late. And he will get popped. And yeah, that's going to be three for nothing. Void Boy now caught out as well. That's four. And the fifth one will be Ima Kutupai, who's going to try to get away with that. Make a lot of noise for the new World Champions, Moscow 5! straight in towards that fight. Here we go then, all hanging around by the middle. Actually, Alex just diving away, but Cloud Temple gonna get the ulti down. There is a crescendo coming out of Edward. He's already fairly low, and look at Rapid Star falling so, so quickly. Cloud Temple now the focus from that one. We are gonna see Alex Hitch come in. He's got the reset. He's gonna jump over, gets the slow across all three. Alex going low, he was exhausted, and then not even finished off by that one. Graves goes down, Mad Life pulls Darian in towards the turret. He's gonna walk away with hardly anything. Mad Life doing a lot of the same Gendra actually tanking to Oh, can we gonna go for it? Yes, they are. They're jumping in there because of the sad mommy used very early. Alex is just gonna get flipped around, but the damage is not really targeted. And Crescendo hits the entire Azumi from team. Beautiful from Edward there. Now the damage goes out. Shy is taking down for it. No, the rock is running through. Rapid is gonna try and do it out, but he's gonna get the lead on. That's gonna be Cloud Tempo taking down as well. Good one gets dropped by Gendra. They grab Tumbo from Rapid Star. One turn around. Behind him, obviously, uh, Rapid Start is what Cloud Temple going to do. There is the ultimate coming down, really working out nicely. And there's Alex Sims actually dying by Rapid Start on camp right on top of him. He managed to survive along with Sims, but maybe he's got the Guardian Angel oh. and finishes it on the pit. Azumu from Can they stop the Dragon Knight here in League of Legends? 
coming around the backside. And you can see Flower Templar is going in for. There's a teleport coming in as well. Alex, this is going to join the party on towards Shy. Shy taking down very low. There's first blood. They couldn't get a double kill here. They're coming towards it. They will. And it's Alex who's to pick up the kill. Genja taking down of out of sorts at the moment and again just putting a damage down on him he could try and follow through on this one he will he's gonna arc and shield through manage manage shield pop he's good star puts the ultimate down catches everyone out they're going in though it's gonna be a diamond towards madlock get just desperately taking the turning out he gets it down rapid star gets taken down so madlock gets dropped as well they get a diamond towards it they can't catch up towards cloud templar one more hit will be in darian takes it down darian's gonna go towards rapid star rapid star is ed edmund's gonna take the tower damage it's obliteration now for Azumu Frost. Brutalized though here. Shy is being picked off by Alex Inch and Diamond Brox. Shy is going to go down. Meanwhile, down the side there. There goes Shy. Oh, he's flashed away, but it doesn't matter. Now he and they're coming back in here, Azuma. They want another go. They've all healed up. But look at Templar. He's the big tank in the team, and he's just been absolutely destroyed. Wound the next focus. He goes down. Kill for Alex Inch there. Mad Life now the next target. Darian going to destroy him along with Diamond. Rapid stuff now. Last man left alive. He is going to fall down. Double kill in the end there. For Genja. And Gambit Gaming are going to take the Nexus down. At 2-0 at the Vufros. It's GG, GG for Gambit. Comes in bottom. Well, Ambition teleports it in. He's going to have to flash and try and drive to the kid. It's going to be good. Edward, they go for back. Look at Genja turning the aggression towards Ambition. The Ignite going down. Now he's on towards Captain Jack. Here comes Diamond Prox around the side. They're going to get on towards Captain Jack. It's going to be burnt. Look, Captain Jack goes down. Alex is coming around the side now. He's going to push the wave. They're going to go in towards Ambition. Everything comes around. Alex tries to pull the damage down. Edward picks up the kill. Now they're on towards this point. Alex is going to continue chasing this one. Has he got the damage? No. But it doesn't matter, it's a 2-0, great start. And this is like what happened in the second game just previously be between Azubu Frost. They got a double kill under this turret, and from there, Genja and Edward just ran away with the lane. Another dive. If they don't ditch the turret right now, they're going to get double killed. Here we go then, this is bad news. Ultimate comes down, there's the first one. Captain Jack low, Captain Jack's dead. A double kill for Edward. 3-0-1. An irony of when we're talking about William play. And he may just go over the top. Here comes Genja on towards Helios. Can they lock him down? Yes, they certainly can with Renault. On to this one, the rest of the team coming around. Oh, he's going to be a big one. Two shot for Ars comes across. Crescendo didn't land, but it doesn't help. It doesn't overextend on this one. Darian is on towards Flame, Emo Flame has gone down, and that may just fall. And this is just total domination. What did they do in the last two days to improve from the team that went one and two in the group stage to winning three games in a row against Azubu Frost and now Azubu Blaze? They're just looking to tutorial style and take all the other turrets, get their goal be even bigger. Baron Mutt has forever left. They're just... Wow! 22 minutes in, the surrender from Azubu Blaze. They they can't. Game number one, what a stomp for uh, Gambit Gaming. We got a surrender out of Azubu Blaze. Bottom there, we're going to see Captain Jack coming in. They're going to dive in. His lost boy's going to get taken out. First one can't come out. Yes, he will. It's Shin's out picking it up. It's time to There's the return kill. He got taken down Edward. Now they're going to flash you on towards Captain Jack. Two flashes going through. Get your arm and shit through. He picks it. Three members of Gambit Gaming all piling out the jungle straight towards you. And he's just going to get the they're going to go diving straight in towards Flame. They're Captain Jack against them. They're going to go straight in. That is they absolutely exploded from the map. And this could be it. This could be a big, big push from Gambit. They're going to take the inhibitor and the inhibitor as well. 2.30 second plus death powers on Azubu. They might put the Careful here with this one, gonna get slowed down, he's gonna dash off to the minion, flashes away from the knockout, but it's not gonna be enough to get away. Actually repelled and managed to get himself oh. to safety. They're going in towards Peke. Finally, we see Diamond go down, but there's the crescendo coming across, and they're picking up kills left and right. A double kill for Diamond. Not exactly weak on his own, and he dives in on towards Reckless with the unstoppable force. Reckless will not get away. 
joining that tournament. And uh, we only 7,000 difference. Good lord, did anyone see Reckless? Because I didn't. Let's Alex just up. peek around the corner. He's going to get caught. He's going to get destroyed. That is a complete multi kill. And it's going to become all she wrote for Fnatic. That will be Gambit surely taking game one. In. Cyanide is actually coming in from this one. We're going to see Diamond getting involved in this one. Yellow Star going very, very low. Where is the ultimate arrow? Diamond is going to put down so much damage. It's a double kill in the end for Genja. No, it wasn't. It was Reckless yeah, auto attack that killed him. But Diamond's coming down. Where's the ulti coming in? There's a bomb from Ziggs. Diamond picks up the kill anyway. And they're going to keep the pressure. Cyanide low. Yellow Star's dead. He's not going to escape that. Alex with the last hop of that water balloon going to get the... Well, I would say, but yeah, obviously not against the Russians. Edward down in the bottom lane, he's gonna die from this one, or is he? No, he's not. Cyanide gets a blood well pump. Here comes Diamond. Cyanide is a dead man, he will fall to that one. And now they chase him. Genja rooted under the tower. He's got enough. 29 5 joke. Yeah. What a performance Gambit have put in. We shouldn't really have questioned it. It's Gambit and the Intel Extreme Masters. Yeah, they are the masters of the Intel Extreme Masters, and they are going to take down the first Nexus turret. Can't see Fnatic being able to stop the me, I think. And Alex now gonna try and burst down Ryu. Has he got the damage for this one there? So Zonya's gonna be used. Alex pops his ultimate from this one. Super Mega Death Rock. He comes across the side. Diamond is gonna be in there as well. Who are they gonna go for? They decide on Diamond. He stands on the jumpers. The slow actually not connecting onto him there. And there is the kill on towards Insect. They shut down. Leopard's now gonna be chased what? down. The play coming in onto him. And that is three kills for Gambi. And truly the Baron for them now. So what on earth is happening? Gambit had the position around Baron there, got some good water. Well, now worn off, they're continuing to keep this pressure on. KT Bullets may try and make a play off this one. They've realized that the buff is down. They do manage to go in towards it and look at the damage on Genja. Now they're going to see KT Bullets. They're going to pursue. Talisman's both being popped in. They're jumping on towards Darius. Meanwhile, coming around the backside. The kick comes in. The Alex jumps in. Who's he going to catch on towards? Score speed, take a look. Score goes down. They're jumping on Insect. Insect, take a look. The gun does manage to get him into double cover. Darius, that's going to be three now. Alex is jumped in. He goes in so much. They jump on Leopard. This could be the end. going to be the focus, but look at the position. KT Bullets, they're looking back for a backdoor. Back back door. Door. It's going to be a pace race. They're going to go around the backside. Gambit are on the top of the map. They've got Leopard in the oh mid lane right word. now. Leopard's going up there. He's going to be the one that's oh going to stop God. them from recalling from this. They've taken down the inner turret. There is they're Leopard going. spotted by the... They're going to use the tallies with... They're going for this one. Leopard is going to be chased by Gambit. They don't have time. They can't do that. They cannot go for Leopard. They're trying to recall right now. But they're My going in for the next assault. Can you believe it? The KT Bullets no go straight through into the base. Kenji comes down as well. But the next assault. one I'd say in favor of CLG counter logic gaming took down Raka which looked like it wasn't to be the favor for the tournament um it's really it's really hard to say, say so yeah sure 3-1 CLG but Gambit could surprise me and I've been wrong before I think 
Three on CLG. Okay. Middle lane once again. Nick might have to be careful too. though. He is a little bit lower. Think Card will dive in. Nick will get this done off here to Link, but I don't think that they've got the oh, fall no. through damage. Think Card is underneath the tower. He's going to take one more hit. He goes down and Diamond will get first blood. Nick's low HP. He looks like he's going to try and come around. There's a knockoff of Diamond Ooh. on Sejuani. He gets the double kill here in the final. And yesterday, Diamond. Oh, he's going again. Oh, he wants more in this mid lane. Trying to get in onto Link. He still he's doesn't have flash. He's not oh. level six. And guess what? He's got. What oh, nice little chain landed. What? Not actually blocking. Look at Pinoy going Whoa. aggressive. We'll throw the ulti in. There's a flash. One more auto oh, attack. We'll do it. And he might. Gonna look towards him. But Eddie pulls out the lantern. Back onto double lift. Can't turn it around. Pinoy gets the kill. He's about to pull a ward straight in his head, comes straight charging across, tries to lock on towards him. He has got his ultimate available now, remember, he could lock him down. Zion Spartan comes around, dashes onto Kamashan, wow. he turns into Meganar. He's tanking it through, will flash. Disengage! Oh, <laughs> Holy... Can they take more from this one? Zion Spartan comes in, there's the ulti from Dioplox, Meganar comes out, misses his combo, oh. does get the slam on CLG, points them on the wall. Aphromoo's gonna get taken down, Pinoy comes around the side, can they get yet more from this one? It's a tough one. Oh, he's bottom lane. Oh, the close by. Oh, he's gonna wait for him. Oh, no, we'll hop away, but here comes Nick from the side, he's gone for double lift, but there is a summoner he'll use, I think he might be able to oh, escape, no, no the last tick of the Ignite will get him, and that leaves Zion Spartan versus Stream, meanwhile Diamond, here comes Pinoy as well in the jungle, they get set up perfectly, he bursts them down with the ultimate, Big Card will hop away, Kamashot actually got knocked up, but a double ultimate against the wall, and the hook on to Afro as well, and that is four men down here for TLG, and now, if they need their battle, Our deepest fear is not that we are inadequate. Our deepest fear is that we are powerful beyond measure. Beyond measure. I'm gonna show you how great I am. Last night I cut the light off in my bedroom, hit the switch, was in the bed before the room was dark. I'm gonna show you how great I am. Only last week I murdered a rock, injured a stone, hospitalize a brick. I'm so mean, I make medicine sick. I'm gonna show you how great I am. This kid's gonna be the best kid in the world. This kid's gonna be somebody better than anybody ever knew. I'm gonna show you how great I am. I have rousing with an alligator. I done tussled with a whale. I done handcuffed lightning, throw thunder in I'm gonna show you how great I am. All of you chumps are gonna bow when I whip him. All of you, I know you got him. I know you got him picked, but the man's in trouble. I'm gonna show you how great I am. But somewhere along the line, you changed. You stopped being you. You let people stick a finger in your face and tell you you're no good. And when things got hard, you started looking for something to blame. Like a big shadow. Let me tell you something you already know. The world ain't all sunshine and rainbows. It's a very mean and nasty place, and I don't care how tough you are, it will beat you to your knees and keep you there permanently to your leg. You, me, or nobody is gonna hit as hard as life. But it ain't about how hard you hit. It's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward. How much you can take and keep moving forward. That's how winning is done. Because if you're willing to go through all the battling you got to go through to get to where you want to get, who's got the right to stop you? I mean, maybe some of you guys got something you never finished, something you really want to do, something you never said to somebody, something. And you're told no, even after you pay your dues, who's got the right to tell you that? Who? Nobody. It's your right to listen to your gut, and ain't nobody's right to say no. After you earn the right to be where you want to be and do what you want to do. away on the Nexus, they'll take that down and Gambit Gaming are the champions of the Intel Extreme Masters Cologne. Wow, just like that, the game is over. Just as
way behind in CS, but it doesn't matter. He's got the Zonias. Oh, Kamishan actually caught out here. Oh, the stunts quickly turns things around. There's going to be the man drop. Coral JJ in trouble. Diamond will come on, and that will.